You're looking down on the biggest house in college football, Michigan Stadium, Ann Arbor. Today, more than 100,000 people will come for an 80th consecutive time to watch the Michigan Wolverines play against the number one team in the nation, the Miami Hurricanes. Miami opened their season, beating the preseason favorite Florida State 31 to nothing. Coach Jimmy Johnson, fifth season, 42 and eight. They've won their last 19 road games. They have the nation's longest winning streak at 13 straight. Now listen to it. weighs over 300 pounds. Huzar weighs right at 300 pounds. Ball is just short of the 40-yard line in Miami territory. And Taylor back on second down. Pulls it down, takes off, and he's run down from behind. He works with Bill Hawkins, Russ Maryland, and Willis McGeese. The backers are also very fast people from Clark and Shannon, and one of their best, Rod Carter, is not playing because of knee surgery. Barry Harden, McDowell, and Ellis. Galloway is back in. Michigan, three wide outs. Third down and not eight. Taylor has pass thrown underneath for the tight end, Derek Walker, a senior double wide top of the picture. On first down, Taylor goes to Bowles. Tony Bowles gets in there. Michigan Stadium, second down and eight for the Wolverines. Just inside the Miami 25. Taylor takes off. To the 13 and a first down for Michigan. Just short of the 13. First down for the Wolverines. Ball goes to Bulls, bounces to the outside to the 10. Don Colasar wide at the top of the picture. Michigan operating. Out of the eye formation. It's Tony Bowles to the five. Tracy Williams checks in as Michigan goes to the wishbone. Set up their option behind Michael Taylor. Rides it off to the first man. That's Jared Bunch. The poet brings up a fourth down. Mike Gillette will go for the three points to get something out of this possession. And he gets 
a 22-yard field goal through the heart of the uprights, and the Wolverines get on the board. So Mike Gillette gets the field goal try, and Bo Schimbeck for taking the points instead of gambling. Yeah, so yep. the three points is a good choice. Third and it goes back to Hill, and this time he's at the one-yard line, and again he's got a little daylight to the outside, but the pursuit this time is better for the Michigan Day here on ABC Sports. That's Cleveland Gary, the fullback, bouncing outside with it to find some daylight, and he's close to the marker. Gary, the fullback, has been the most productive in the first ball game. This is Conley, and he's snowed under. He the defensive coverages, and he can audibleize, and, and he can put us in the right play right there from the screen. In the throw to the wide receiver. Walsh has good protection. Goes down the middle to the big guy from Toledo, Rob Chizinski. From midfield on first down, Walsh hands the ball inside. Gary. He and uh, Conley wound up in the same hole. Second down, seven. Steve Walsh throws quickly. Gary pulls it in. Cleveland Gary shakes two tacklers and breaks it down the sidelines and will score a touchdown. No flag. He ran right through David Arnold. 49 yards. The holder is Kirk Sandifer. The kick is good. And seven minutes and 49 seconds to go in the first quarter. and he seldom gets caught eating the ball. Here's the kickoff by Edgar Pennis, way back in the end zone. Strong leg, and now Michael Taylor. He came out throwing in the first possession and almost got it up to Turns around and gives it to Bowles, who pops it over the left side. Bowles is a very quick running back down the sideline. He is caught from behind. Seven to three, Miami. to the sidelines is good. They're, They're a very cool team. Downfield against the offense. First down. When you win 19 straight road games. On a little delay to Bowles. Bowles got the block at the line of scrimmage. Second down, 11 for Michigan. Taylor chased out of the pocket. It's third down and a long six. Taylor's pass is caught. Michael threw him a knuckleball, but he reeled it in. First down at the Miami 49. Taylor dropping back, hands to Bowles. Tony Bowles is going to be ridden down. Bowles again. A different offensive alignment for the Wolverines. They do have some option stuff in their offense. Taylor's chased out of there. He's got room. Michael Taylor. And so the Wolverines have a first down. They go back to Tony Bowles into the middle of the Beavers. And it's a personal foul. And it's called against the Wolverines and called against Miami. So it's offsetting personal foul. Second down and eight. Taylor with a deep drop goes into the end zone for McMurtry. And McMurtry gets tangled up and minutes to go in the first quarter. Taylor swings it out to the sidelines to Bowles, and Bowles makes the catch all right from 46 yards. Not leg, but he missed it. He had plenty on it. First down at their own 29. And Walsh straight back to throw it. Steve pumps it up in the air. Loops it for Dukins, and it is overthrown. Personal foul. Dead ball foul, so it'll be second down and 25. Give it to Cleveland Gary, and he is put on his back. Steve Walsh will put it up, goes the sideline, and the pass is caught out of bounds. He nailed one for 59 yards under pressure. 
He didn't get all of this one. Callaway comes up, makes the catch at the 46, and takes it back to the 40. That's been productive so far for Michigan. Watch the reverse. There it is. Bowles has got it. Block on the corner. He's got a man front to beat. He gets a block there. A whole lot of running, a whole lot of yelling, and no game. Second down at about 10. Taylor will throw it. Has a man. McMurtry. And he's got a first down. Or maybe the fastest of the month. On first down, double wide, bottom of the picture. Taylor gives it off to the running back, Tony Bull. They're showing uh, what amounts to a 4-3. With that corner coming up, it is Bulls cutting it back in the middle to about the 20. Third down and a long four for Michigan as Taylor drops the throw and that takes off. Bounces off one of his own men and will go down. At least a yard short of the first down. Mike Gillette is in for a field goal try. He missed wide right for 46. This is from 34. And he missed that one. So Mike Gillette, the place kicker for Michigan, is 0 for 2 from 46. Uh, excuse me, 1 for 3. On first down, Waltz back to throw it. Has a lot time and dumps it off to Leonard Conley out of the backfield and Conley's up around the 27 yard line. Number one ranked Miami leading the Michigan Wolverines ranked number 16 in the country by score of 7-3 after one. Three of those members of that good year crew are from Miami and uh, this is Leonard Conley caught behind the line of scrimmage and run down. See you Benny thanks for joining us and uh Good luck, Hurricanes, huh? Okay. The pass, a little good snap to Galal. No pressure on him. Spins it out this time, forcing a fair catch ball by Chris Galloway. Michael Taylor, the quarterback, gives to Tony Bowles. Bowles spins it in the middle. Galloway in motion. They're running it. Penalty flag. comes back to the 44 for the car wreck. None of the Kentucky party injured on the play or injured on the accident. On this play, it is Taylor ducking the ball to his tight end, Walker. This is Bowles for the outside. Puts his head down and gets the first down. He ran right over Ken Berry. At the Miami 32, Bowles again. And he's down to the 26. Michigan procedure call in Chuck Hartley's name. Make it second down and right at 10. Pass is short to Kolasar. Michigan four out of seven on third down conversions. Taylor back to throw. Gets some heat. Gets it off down the middle. Tight end is good. And Derek Walker has a first down. Ball is on the 12. Bowles is back in. Here they come. Bowles gets a yard. Second down. Call it nine. Ball just inside the Miami 12-yard line. Michael Taylor. And so it's third down. The ball comes back to the 13. Bowles is out. Taylor into the end zone. No. Off the hand of John Colasar's fourth field goal try. He's one out of three. And this one is good. So now he is two for two, and he tightens it up a bit. 7 to 6. 9.59 to play in the first half. Crowd of more than 100,000 at Michigan Stadium in Ann Arbor. A scoreboard. Knuckle ball down the middle. Oh, Randall Hill has to go all the way back to his three. Put it up. Intended for Dale Dawkins in <laughs> underneath. Crowell, Shannon Crowell, a sophomore. Following the uh, quarterbacks in the country, uh, Holzer. <laughs> but uh, 
they're just holding them. Uh, Third down and about seven. Six, six and a half. Walsh again underneath. Gary, the fullback, out of the backfield. Very, very good pass receiver. Gary. Cleveland Gary. That was the longest running play of the game. In fact, that play was 12 yards, and all of their running efforts prior to that had netted only 11 yards, and Gary this time is buried. All day. Dumps it off to Cleveland Gary, who outruns number 30, but then gets caught on the sideline. The beat. Messner comes blasting through on Waltz. Pass complete to Gary. Run down at the 45. They've got 10 blue shirts up. They fake it. And it's good for a first down with Doyle Aaron, a wide receiver. And he races way deep into Michigan territory all the way to the Wolverine 21. And on first down, they turn and give it to Shannon Crowell. And Crowell will pick up a couple. I have a dead ball, personal foul, kicking on a first down. So the Sooners are left with Jamel Holloway leading by 11 over Arizona in the third. Carrying is Shannon Crowell here at Michigan Stadium. Fourth and down and goal. Crowell, no. Cleveland Gary is the deep man. Tracy Waiters is the up man out of the eye. Goes to Gary on the dive. Touchdown, Miami! All right, the extra point try by Huerta. And we're right at three minutes. The play in the first half, and Miami leads 14 to 6. That's the Huron. part of the Miami offense. That is a high, high hanger. And it is Tony Bowles. And he's out of bounds to kill the clock being kept on the field. 37-yard line. Michael Taylor, a little delay, gets a good block to help him out. Throws underneath and the pass is incomplete. Yeah, Callaway with second down and ten. Throw it underneath the screen for Bowles. Tony Bowles to the sidelines. Stepping nicely and will stop the clock. First down, Michigan. Little delay with Bowles and caught by Clark. Second down, right at five. Well, Bowles dropped the ball and it rolled right to the Miami man. Straight at him. Now it's 58. It's Pegues, Willis Pegues. But somehow he didn't get it. Third down and seven. There's the loss of a couple in there. Taylor loops it for Kolasar. Out of bounds, 17-yard line of Miami. Let's tell me how they get there. Come to 17 on first down. Taylor up the middle. 10, 6, right about the 5. The left hander is now in. Taylor's taken up, had to come out. Goes to Bowles to the five and just over it to the four. And he's in there on second down and goal from the five yard line. Stay in the wishbone. Taylor still got it. Throws in the end zone. Touchdown. Jeff Brown. They're illegal, huh? Only if you make contact. <laughs> Taylor's getting backside pressure. Run down by Greg Mark. 57 seconds. They got two timeouts to work with. That's a low skidding kick. They didn't handle the last one too well, but this one's picked off by Daryl Spencer with a full head of steam. To the 35-36 fumble. Michigan's got it. Michael 
Taylor. Three wideouts. To the sideline. Callaway. Catch is good. Little shovel pass. That's an incomplete. Taylor takes off to the sideline. So it's being kept down on the field. Taylor gets it off into the end zone. Kodasar, touchdown! What a throw! What a catch! he could deliver his pass. This time they give it away to the fullback. Chris Horn takes it in for the two points. So again, Michigan deceives Miami. back to the near the goal line where Spencer is going to be called down on the two yard line you had Hill and Spencer back there Walt takes the snap starts the clock and we'll go to the clubhouse at halftime well, the Wolverines of Michigan leading the Hurricanes of Miami by a score of 20 to 14 So they're lowering in Ann Arbor, Al, as we switch to our studios in New York. The go-ahead touchdown for Michigan, and Dennis hits it. He gets it up well, forces Bowles to wait at the three. He's got a hole. To the 37, John Vitale over the ball at center. And it's Bowles searching around for a crack, and he found one. Second down at about two. Fair size collision as Miami jumps into the Bear defense as Taylor Hopkins down the line and turns back short of the first down. Possession. Ah, beautiful kick by Gillette. Angling it for the corner. Gives it to Cleveland, Gary, and Cleveland. And Waltz will put it up to the sidelines, to Gary. Gary, fighting, gets the first down. Wolverine flips, and Gary goes down. Trip Wellburn, the safety. Waltz to put it up. Down the middle, it is good to Gary. Gary with a move, got three Wolverines for first down Miami at their own 35. This possession started at their one. Walt, Rose, Dawkins, Pitcher, and picks up nine. He throw it again, big, Hill. No, no, third and one. Then some. He's 170 pounds. He'll be shorter than that. Well, it's a late hit. On, Michigan leading 20 to 14. Oh, yeah. Walsh oh, yeah. continues to throw it. As a man. Pass is caught by Chudzinski. The tight end. From the 12. Walsh lost it into the end zone. Just beyond the hands of Cleveland Gary. Dawkins intercepted on the ricochet by Vader Murray. And out of bounds at the 20. Leading 20 to 14. And 
This is Tony Bowles. To about the 24. Ball well, just short of the 25. Second down and six. Bowles again. Chris Horn is now in the backfield with Bowles. And down goes Taylor as Russell Maryland beats the blocker. Oh, he's one punt today with 52 yards. Some pressure on him, and he didn't get all of it. But he does get a good roll on it. And Spencer lets it roll, and it goes down to the Miami 31-yard line. From the 31, Walsh gives it to Cleveland Gary. Back in the 40s. <laughs> uh -oh. Miami. Procedure. Here is it. <laughs> From the 30, back goes Walsh. Gets it off to the sidelines and incomplete. Michigan leads 20 to 14. Here's Gary. Intercepted. The second ricochet for Veda Murray. Not Walsh's fault. And Michigan has it first down at their own 46. This is Tony Bowles trying to bounce outside. And he does. Second down and four. again. First down by Tracy Williams, a junior out of Sarasota, Florida. He's got a good man in strong. He'll do well for him. He's a smart quarterback. All short of the 41. And Taylor back. Let's it fly. Good down the middle to Jeff Brown. But first down, Michigan at the Miami 20. Goes to Bulls up the middle. And about four yards. Second down and six. Bowles. Oh, what a hit. And the ball loose. Yeah. Miami is arguing for it. Won't get it. Third down. Ball is at the 16. Taylor. Takes off. He's got a first down for Michigan. and goal, wishbone to Bowles, and he stopped at the five. Well, they wouldn't take any chances. Taylor in trouble. Randy Shannon, number 22, which is now third down. And that's thrown away. 29 yards. And he drew it. Got a strong leg. And Michigan builds its lead over Miami to 23-14. And the clock shows, if it is correct, 1.40 to play in the third quarter. And right now, the big old bowl of that armor is coming. So the home team is leading. So that hammers it. And Spencer gets away from it and lets Hill have it. And the Wolverines let Hill have it up around the 21-22. They lead by 9, 23-14. Miami goes to work just beyond the 21. Steve Walsh to throw. He's been intercepted in the last two possessions. That one was tipped, and Michigan had a shot at that one. Underneath to Gary. Gary is caught and wrestled down by David Key. And third and five for the Hurricanes. Gary down the middle and Walsh missed him. Hit one yet. Galloway is deep for Michigan. Got a little better rhythm on that one. And Callaway will go down. First down just outside their 32 yard line. Michael Taylor is going to star today. Tony Bowles is going to work for us today. Yeah, but he's quicker. Speed against Tom. Little hand off to Bowles and a big hole. 45-yard line. Holds again. Got a quarter to go in the ball game. Michigan, 23, and Miami, the top-ranked team in the country, 14. Just 15 minutes, and the top-ranked team in the country is trailing by nine, and 
the leading team, Michigan, has the ball. Second down and four. Tony Bowles. And he's greeted by Randy Shannon. To see Williams goes in motion. Bowles is out right now. Taylor's pass to the sideline. McMurtry for a first down. Greg McMurtry just inside the 38. There goes Williams. the corner, Kenny Berry. I think he was down beat you've ever seen. This week he's hung in there pretty well. Right now he's out because one of those puppies is barking. <laughs> and Brown is back to throw it. Down the middle, tight end, Walker, first down. Whoa, what a confidence puffer that could be for Demetrius Brown. Just inside the 14, officially probably the 13. Tony Bowles, if you're that good, that coordinated, that size, Taylor's back in at quarterback, missed by one, but hunted down and run down, you know, good 12, close to 13. Taylor's pass to the corner, touchdown, Callaway! Dawkins. This dance ain't over. Seven minutes to play. Walsh back to throw. Got another. Oh, Conley can't pull it in. Second down and ten. A little quick one. And Conley can't handle it at third and ten. Yeah. Is it good? Yes, sir. He's inbound. The team. Walsh back. Gets it off, under pressure, down the middle. Chudzinski, the big tight end from Toledo, pulls it in. Good two-minute drill right here. Underneath, pass good. Gain to about the 19. Last time they were down knocking on the door, they turned it over. Walsh down the middle, throws it away. On the balance, first, second, and third down. Third down, caught by Chudzinski. He's got it. First down. Dawkins to about the seven. 
Second down. And that pass intended for Conley. But Third down. That's good. Chudzinski. Touchdown, Miami. He beat Beta Murray to get the TD at 5.23 to play. They get it as Walt hits Duncan. That's a big two points, too. You bet. They're one touchdown and an extra point, or two points away from tying it. It is now 30 Michigan, 22 Miami. Got all of it. Bowls at the two. It's first down Michigan from their 14-yard line. Here's where you really, really need the power of... Bowles gets a hold of the outside and gets it up to around the 20. On third and a long four. Taylor's pass. McMurtry makes... Dead ball, illegal procedure against the offense. Michigan needs a big one. It's a low line drive. Spencer's back and had called a fair catch. He had room to run. Taylor throws under pressure, incomplete. In and out of the hands of Shannon Crowell. Chudzinski. Chudzinski has caught six balls for 77 yards. Walsh back to, that is not a first down. I called it first, it is not a first, and that pass is incomplete. It is Gary, first down at the 30, the 25, the 20, he's on his way. Two and the tie. Intercepted. If they're tackling, he can run. Well, he went down with it. Well, David Arnold. So now Miami must kick it off to Michigan. And the Michigan offense really needs to reel off a couple of first downs. Three timeouts. Maybe, Maybe he's going to wanna... pooch it or something, huh? Yeah, it certainly looks like an onside. Maybe he's going to pop it up. No, they go the onside. They got a chance. They got it. Miami got the ball. Bobby Hurton, the strong safety, went up in the air and got it at the Michigan 47-yard line. Receivers and defensive back. Walks back on first down from the Michigan 47 down the middle. It is intended for Chudzinski and incomplete. Second down and 10. Blitz. Outside, Andre Brown makes the catch. Here they come again. Gary running it. Still going with it. Michigan defensive people look tired on that play. All right, here it is. First down. Clock running. They'll run it. Goes to Crowell and Crowell. Second down, about nine. They'll run it again. I mean, there is nothing there. Third down from the Michigan 15. Well, they give it to Conley. Run it back into the middle of the field. And now it's up to Huerta. It's a 29-yard try. Snap was low. The kick is away. The kick is back. And Miami has gone to a 31-30 lead over the Michigan Wolverines with 43 
seconds to play. Sideline down. Taylor gets it away. The ball is caught by Bowles at the 40. Steps out of bounds. Michigan hasn't opened the season 0-2 since 1959. So Demetrius Brown is in for the play. Taylor had to come out dragging his leg. Demetrius Brown rolls right, throws left-handed. Sideline. That's an Oh, no. They don't call it. Maybe it wasn't a catchable ball. And there's one of the Michigan men leaving. Key, the defensive back. Brown shakes him off and throws it. It's into the crowd. Colazar is shoved down in the melee. And the time runs out. And the Miami Hurricanes is one of the most dramatic comebacks you have ever seen. of the ball game to beat Michigan 31 to 30.